Hey guys, it's Vecito, aka Victoria. Yes, I am sitting in my closet. It's very comfortable in here. It's my safe place. <laughs> so, first off, let me apologize as to why I haven't been posting lately. I've been tied up in school doing accounting. It's my last year. <sighs> you know, school is like a terror in the way of me doing videos because it requires such a commitment and sometimes at the end of the day I'm just like <sighs> maybe a little vampire diaries or a little a little game of thrones <sighs> you know oh, come on you know what I mean but I really want to be able to have a viewership and Put out some damn good stuff. I've got another video lined up. Um, very sweet, very heartwarming, but gotta give it that comedic touch. By the way, I feel like this is gonna be my spot where I may or may not talk often, so get you- Oh, hello? Hello? Yes? Bello? Bello? Speaking of that, I do, uh, I do like these guys. What I did want to talk to you guys about today was, as you all know, um, Sunday or Monday was the Canadian Thanksgiving holiday. Now, obviously, you get together with family. Now, getting together with my family, usually, it's always pretty interesting. I was sitting down with one of my relatives, one of my aunts, and I'm like, nice shoes. They look pretty fancy. You know what she told me? She told me it was from a recently passed away relative. <laughs> I find that really weird. Uh, leave me a comment below if you find it weird too. But honestly, would you wear one of your deceased, dearly departed relative's clothes? I just find it weird. Like, you know, like their spirit is... is still lingering and like you can't wear their clothes because they might they, they might they might come back alive they might want their clothes they might want their clothes that might be crazy of me to think i'm not talking about you know your cousin or your aunt or whoever it is gave you an and gave you an item gave you an item of clothing and you know last year and they passed away that that's different but i'm talking about okay 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 would you wear you know let's say let's say your dear old aunt let's say your dear old aunt or uncle whatever let's say they passed away unfortunately they passed away now a week later, will you be wearing their baseball cap or their sweater? Like, wouldn't their ghosts come for you? Like, ah! I don't know. Like, I understand inheritance, you know? They give you the house. They, they give you your their teapot that they used to use. They do all of that. But I feel a little bit, I feel a little chills. I feel a little bit chilly in, in my spine to wear someone who who's recently deceased to 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 go in their closet to go in their closet where is this to go in their closet you know just just take out their clothes and be like hmm i think i'll take that looks nice you know i don't know about that that kind of that kind of business trips me out a bit what do you think? Am I nuts? I feel like there's still some spirit in the clothes and that clothes swapping business is like a little bit too early. Or how long would you say? Like maybe, I don't know. But she was like, what? These are perfectly good shoes. The lady's dead. She can't wear them. I don't know. Comment below. Would you 
wear a deceased family member's clothes immediately? Or how would you feel about that? Let me know. And thanks for watching. Till next time. I have so many ideas that are just sitting on a, on a, on a piece of paper waiting to be done. But I wanted to make a quick video today because I was like, I can't keep waiting and waiting and waiting. I just wanted to say I felt guilty about not being able to post videos because I actually love posting videos. I love it.